Fox here back with a brand new video. So in this video we are going to be talking about the update which just landed in Clash of Clans a few days ago. So I, I know I'm actually late in making this video and but I was actually busy in my school stuff so I really didn't have time. So now that I'm free I'm going to be shooting this video. So in this video we are going to be discussing about the latest features which just popped, uh, popped into the game. So now um, there are a lot of couple of features like the new defense, um, um, the new levels which a few of the troops have received, and a few def uh, a def few defenses have received a few levels, and a troop has um, a few balancing changes have has been uh, have been made as well, and. Yes guys, so let's get right on to it. So the first feature in the game is the new defense, which is the bomb tower. And uh, I really like the bomb tower guys. It has just been tossed in from Royale to Clash of Clans. And I think it is really, really cool and does a lot of damage. And especially when it is destroyed and the giant bomb which is left out does some massive damage damage guys now few of the players have been uh, saying that this up, uh, update is absolutely bullshit but i think this is really really good one guys and i was just going through global a few days ago and i saw hate comments for this update and um i really didn't know why i asked them but they didn't give me a proper reply so now um the f uh, next feature we're going to be talking about is the new um levels which the troops have re received so the first one is the level 7 wizard which looks absolutely amazing um it has a, a few golden uh lining on its red coat which makes it a, a badass and it looks really really cool guys and it does some heavy damage as well and now the level 6 wizard can be unlocked at Le town hall 9 which uh, makes it really really awesome. So, uh, for example, if you have a level five clan and your clan mate uh, and your highest town hall player in your clan is a town hall nine, and you need a max wizard. So, if he gives you a level six wizard due to your plan, uh, clan perks, sorry, due to your clan perks, you will get a level seven wizard, which is really awesome, guys. And yeah, that is one of my favorite features in the game. And the next thing is. The dragon, the dragon has yeah, been given a boost to level 6, which looks amazing. Even the baby dragon and the dragon both look amazing and badass. And they do some real damage, guys. So, I'm sure now players will be coming up with different strategies. And now, the Teslas don't do double damage to Peckers. And this was really, really needed in the game, guys, as Peckers were dying. And I think they were already dead. Now, they'll rise up like zombies. Now, um, the giant bomb also don't do double damage to hogs, which is really awesome. So, I just can't wait to see the various strategies the top players come up with. And now, moving on to the defenses, um, the Expo received an another level, as well as the Tesla. And the Expo looks really badass, guys, as you can see here. And the black and red combination makes it amazing, guys. My favorite... Uh, feature in the defenses is the expo and i really can't wait to get a town hall 11 that's gonna take me a year or um maybe eight nine months still so yeah that's sad that's really really sad and the next thing is the tesla the tesla i honestly didn't like it guys as it looks as if there's a beehive on a tower that um the previous the levels uh what level was it this is a second, guys. I'm really sorry. Yeah, the level 8 Tesla looked really cool. And it looked a bit dangerous and dominating, I would say. But this one looks like a baby. It's not at all good, guys. Level 8 Tesla was amazing. I really done, I didn't like the level 9 Tesla. But I'm sure it does some heavy damage. So, yeah. I can't talk anything more than that on that Tesla because it does really good damage, guys. And the troops will be absolutely roasted. So now the next feature we are going to be discussing about is going to be... Um, yes, guys. Uh, it's the army training. And this uh, feature 
is one of my favorite features and as now you can train multiple armies at once and here you can save all your armies so this is army 1 army 2 and army 3 so basically you can save three armies army 1 is my farming army army 2 is my war army and army 3 is also my war army and it actually sh uh, shows you how much elixir dark elixir you have consumed and the amount of spells you've used for so here my uh, farming army costs up about to 2 lakh 16000 and Darkly is only 14 because of those two minions right there and it also shows you of previous army so you can just hit train um, and it starts training my I already have a built-in army here which I'm going to be using for war and when I go to bar my barracks um, yeah quick I will train troops okay, just a second guys yeah, brew spells. I already have a spell brewed. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna I did this one and just minus a spell. And when I go and hit train, you see my troops start training right away. Previously, guys, you, when after your your two hundred troops have been trained, um, after one troop, the whole army used to get stopped until you have emptied your spaces. So that was a real drawback as now uh, even if you even your army camps are filled up and you are training something in your barracks the whole sequence up to four you can train up to 400 troops at once which is really really amazing and now i can do uh, for like two raids continuously as i take breaks after each raid and my army takes about 20 minutes to train and if i come back after an hour i can do two raids at once which is really amazing guys so now that is one of my favorite feature in this game so and you can actually donate troops which are not even in your army as you can see in my army camp for now i have two golems 14 wizards nine valks six wall breakers now when i go to donate i see you can see that i have two giants which have already been trained in my army and you can see a tick mark right there so that is a really really cool feature guys i think i've covered almost every um uh, uh, feature which have has been released and i think i might have missed out a few balance changes here and there but i really don't know about it so now guys we are gonna be going and attacking live in war guys um i actually got a three star before i attacked three and i actually have five of my accounts in this war and i got six stars in every attack we're actually leading guys and i hope i can get a three star to increase our lead um, so this is the base we are going to be attacking. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to deploy two golems here One is going to go up to this bomb tower right here and another one to this wizard tower And I'm going to give a nice spread to the wizards so that it can take on a few buildings Then we are going to be put, dropping our wall breakers to open up these walls and hopefully we can funnel our Valks in and we can clear up the base and I have hogs in my clan castle this attack strategy is really amazing guys if you're at Town Hall 8 try using Gova Go uh, I don't know what the Go Viva Ice thing or something like that use that with hogs it's really amazing guys and I hope I can get a 3 star to increase my lead so yes guys so hopefully we're gonna be going for live attack war attack this is the first time that I'm doing it on air so let's get started oh my god I'm so frightened Okay, Go golem's going there, golem's going there, I'm gonna give a nice spread to the wizards, so, not yet, Let's see if we can find it. Is also funneled in. Let's see if we can make the whole.
Oh my god, there's tons of giant bombs there. I hope I can pull this off, guys. These hogs do a really good damage. So, I just hope I have... Why is the king not going for the Tesla? King, are you fool or what? What the hell, king? Oh my god, I'm really frightened now. I don't know what's gonna happen. So, I hope I can get a 3-star, guys. Or oh, I'm gonna get bullied by DJ and Mega Man. I know I'm the leader, but I still get bullied. As those two guys. Oh my god, I don't think I'm gonna get two star. What the hell? Oh shit, I actually screwed it up. Those giant bombs actually did a lot of damage to my Valkyries. Let's even take the guy out. Oh my god, I'm actually screwed right now. I think I can get up to 80%. I think I'm gonna get picked by Meg. No, I think it's gonna be DJ. As I actually shoot him for getting um, a two star on five. I actually told him your king sucks. So my king sucks here as well. I'm gonna enter a battle right there as I know that king is gonna die. And I don't wanna let see him die. I can't see him die. He's my precious king. So that's it, guys. I've covered almost everything on this update and done a fail war attack. Um, I hopefully think I win. I have a over. Oh, it's a seven like war win bonus. That's a pretty decent one. Um, yes, guys. Um, if you like this update, please drop a like on this episode. And if you don't like this update, comment down below which feature you don't like of this update. And please hit the like button and the subscribe button if you liked my video. And leave a comment down below of what you think of this video and what are your point of views on this update. You like it or not. This is King Sparks for you. Peace out.